Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Zelda's Adventure. We have an extra piece of power and we are still looking for the noise bar. It should be somewhere in this forest. Ah, now we're on the opposite side of that ford that really you should be able to cross, but apparently you can't. And you even get your ankles wet. And this is the forest of Dorian. Standing on him, that's not good. Fuck, I can't get to it. Quick, quick, for the space. Ah, I can't get around that way. Oh, it's gone. Stupid tree. And the Ubato Hills? Ukato Hills? Some kind of hills on this one. And rock people. Maybe they're meant to be Gorons, which live half submerged in the ride in Hey, old Princess Zelda, friend of Shermak. I Hello, am Sir Basil of Tolomac, and Shermak has sent me to assist you. You so. seem tired now, Zelda. Leave off the contest and come back another day. What? Have I been. Oh, wow. I'll give you a message you've been playing too long. I did not know that. Also, I can't reach that sword Basil just gave me because it's on the opposite side of this very small river that Zelda cannot jump across. How annoying. I guess I'll work my way around. And there's a tent or something there. Let's go inside it. Decided? No, no, you cannot. Ah, uh, tick tights. Oh, please don't sing. Please don't sing. Who rid this land of Farlet and Nave? And to the north she should now go to find what she seeks and wants to know. To find what she seeks and wants to know. Thank you, but I'm not giving you any money. Welcome to our fair village, my princess. We have heard of your coming. Please accept this token of welcome. Token of welcome? Where? Let all around oh, it's another song. Hear my song. Please know. know that Zelda, brave and strong, will rid this land of every sadness. And Ganon too, that prince of badness. Ganon too, that prince of badness. Prince of badness. That just doesn't have the same ring to it as, like, evil king Ganon, the prince of badness. It's very bad. <laughs> you look tired, my lady. I have something you may be able to use. It creates a noise. Use it when you must. Thank you, the noise spell. Why do you have to come all the way to this far off village just to get the noise spell? Apparently her name is Gwynla, according to some... Well, I guess the phoning people. <coughs> but anyway, now I have the noise spell, nothing can stop me. Well, those small, red-eyed, big-eared, blobby, Paul's voice type things, anyway. Back to the Shrine of Illusion. The forest of Torian, past the hills of Ukato, the village of whatever that village is called, 
I didn't see its name. Across the Scottness River. Or whatever it is. Hmm, I left the dealer and I can get there. I guess we'll go and find Sir Basil's sword whilst we're here. The broadsword is a useful weapon for swording people. Oh look, that guy who gave me the feather is dead. <coughs> Pardon me. No green things. Well, that's not enough. Aha, take this green thing. I think it's meant to be a mermaid, actually. Or maybe a fairy or something. It can't seem to get out of the water anyway. Well, whatever. It's a small red thing that restores your health. Why am I going this way? Isn't this a dead end? Yeah, it's not this way. And there is a collapsed castle wall. I wonder what's behind there. And here's the Hail muscle. Princess Zelda, friend of Shermak. I am Sir Basil of Tolomac and Shlomac 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 Let's break him out of that. Stop out of it. Shermak has sent me to assist you. Thanks. You seem tired now, Zelda. Leave off the contest and come back another day. Come back another day, okay, I'll just go and have a rest somewhere. No, we must complete the Shrine of Illusion. <coughs> Stop hiding in the trees, you cowards. Now we can just go in here and kill everything and then our job is two sevens done. Why do items often come in sevens? Oh, I just jumped on this trapdoor. Whee! This is a great sense. Slides and dinosaurs. Dead monsters, circuses, and the undead. They go together like, like uh, two things that really don't go together very well. Now to the noise spell. It's time for you to meet your end. Paul's voice, or whatever you are. Ah. That noise could kill anything. Did you know that in the original Legend of Zelda you could kill the Poles' voices by blowing into the microphone of the second controller? It's true. The Philips CDI does not have a microphone attachment. Well, I don't think there's. Oh, I hate this room. You have to cross this bridge before it vanishes. Oh, I made it. Uh, that's probably about the end of the video, so we'll just stop in this room and you can watch me battle wizards later. Bye bye!